What's up everyone? Welcome to Tech Me Out. Today we're going to be taking a look at a very cool tweet called Anchor. Now what Anchor allows you to do is basically move your icons wherever you want on your home screen and they will snap into place. So an example of that is shown here where I have a widget and then I have my icons placed exactly where I want them to be. This widget was complements of a tweet called iWidget for those of you that are curious. But Back to Anchor, what you will do is you're going to hold your finger on an icon and get them into wiggle mode like you normally would. And then you can successfully like drag your app where you want it to go and it will just snap into place. So no longer will it try to fill the empty space that it normally would. You can now click an icon and put it anywhere you want to on your home screen and it will snap into that location, allowing you to leave empty spots wherever you want. So as you can see here on this page, this is very useful, especially if you use tweaks that allow you to put widgets on your home screen and then it's even nice to just make your layout look different so you can group certain similar apps together like on this page you can create designs it's just allowing you to get your icons exactly where you want them to be now this is a feature that I've personally been wanting without having to use other tweaks like iconoclasm and home screen designer that you may all be familiar with where you can create these same layouts but instead of being able to do it from your home screen you have to go and create a layout with the icons in that structure and then apply that layout. So it's a lot more steps, whereas this is just easy. You know, you install it and you're good to go. So you do have just a few settings for this particular tweak. You can turn anchor on or off, or you can preview what your pages look like in terms of how the icons look on those pages. So this will give you an example of what those icons are, um, how they're laid out on my page one, and then how they're laid out on my page two. And then you'll also notice at the bottom, you have the option to do a soft reset or a hard reset. So in short, the difference between those two are a soft reset will basically take your icons back to their normal layout without a respring, whereas a hard reset will take your icons back to the normal layout with the respring. So I'm going to demonstrate by hitting soft reset on this page and I'm going to go ahead and tell it to reset and I'm going to pop back out to my home screen and you'll notice that even though I told it to reset, it did not move my icons back into their original locations. And that's because I need to respring in order for it to actually take effect. So in essence, it's kind of like telling the app if you wanted to go ahead and uh, restart now or restart later for your changes to take effect and that's really it but that does sum everything up for anchor that's really all there is so for $1.99 in the big boss repo i give it a thumbs up and say it's good to go definitely check it out um, if you have any additional questions or comments drop them down below and if you like this video you already know what to do and as always thanks for taking the time out to let me tech you out and a brief announcement that I want to make. A huge shout out goes to Shar J98. I believe I'm saying that right. Either way, your name's listed in this video. I decided to go with your suggestion, the perfect setup. So simple, but so true in terms of what my new series is going to be in reference to how I have set my phone up. So I'll be giving you a iTunes gift card. So please contact me within the next three days so I can get you your code for your iTunes gift card. Thank you so much for all of your suggestions. It was a truly hard decision to make, but I decided to go with this one because I felt like it really summarized everything in reference to what I'm trying to do for that series. And for those of you that missed that video, basically I'm coming out with a series that's going to show my setup on my iPhone down to my theme, my font, my wallpaper, um, even my case that I have on my phone. So I'm going to give you what I consider the perfect setup for you to check out. And therefore, the series will be called The Perfect Setup. So thank you again, StarJ98. I'll be looking for your message. Hit me up on Twitter with a message. Um, at Tech Me Out. That's a zero instead of an O in the name. T-E-C-H-M-E-0-U-T. And as always, y'all, much love.